Welcome to the Tennis Warehouse Shoe Review of the Mizuno Wave Enforce Tour. Mizuno introduces a comfortable option that is designed for aggressive movers. Offering added stability and durability compared to the Wave Exceed Tour, this shoe has the signature wave plate to reduce shock on impact and creates torsional stability when moving side to side. The Dyna Heel Lock System enhances the support and padding around the ankle while the Dynamotion Upper flexes seamlessly as you move around the court. Inner Z Core material is placed in the midsole for plush comfort and puts extra spring into your step when pushing off. Lastly, the Dew Rubber Outsole holds up well on the hard courts and supplies a good mix of grip and sliding capabilities. The first thing I noticed with this shoe was the fit. Uh, they fit pretty wide, uh, even for me. Uh, I had to wear my thicker TW socks and really cinch up my laces from the bottom all the way to the top to get a more locked in feel. Uh, the other thing I noticed immediately was that these shoes felt more cushioned than the Wave XC Tours. Um, they just feel more substantial in the cushioning uh, compared to those shoes. Uh, now once I got it on court and I had my laces cinched up, I thought the performance of these shoes were very good. Um, I felt very confident moving side to side in them. Um, I really had no issues with it, although I would have preferred a slightly more rigid upper um, or a midfoot shake, I think would have helped uh, in this case as well. Um, but luckily, I thought the outsole was fairly slick, so I was able to slide out of my shots and I didn't feel like I was getting stuck at any point. Um, so overall, I thought this was a great first generation of this shoe. Um, I do prefer it over the Wave XC Tour, I think with a few slight tweaks it would compare uh, to the likes of a barricade or a gel res and I think if you're a player that does have a slightly wider foot and you're looking for a six month durability guarantee uh, this should be at the top of your list. Mizuno's new Wave Enforced Tour checked most of the boxes that are positives for me in terms of what I need out of a good court shoe. I'll start with the things that I really like the most out of it, beginning with out of the box comfort was stellar, midsole cushioning was great, um, sliding around the court, I'm not much of a slider, you can tell at my age, I don't do it deliberately, but if you're into sliding on a hard court, this definitely offered a really good level of friction, grip versus slip. Um, overall, the upper was pretty supportive. It is a wide shoe. It has a pretty deep toe box. So for somebody that maybe is going to consider an aftermarket insert, custom orthotic, you're going to have plenty of vertical clearance there. Uh, the laces are pretty long, so I think that's really going to accommodate an adaptive fit. I don't have the widest foot, but I did, using the laces, get a really good customized secure fit out of the shoe. The heel cup, very cushioned, holds my feet in uh, place very well. I can take width of the shoe up front, but not back, so I didn't have to use any of the empty eyelets. Just overall durability, this is a sole warranty shoe like Jay mentioned. There wasn't really anything uh, but positives out of the shoe. I would consider this for myself maybe more of a practice or a session shoe where game day I'd probably want something a little lighter and lower to the ground. Overall just a great shoe, great play test. Coming into this play test I had high expectations uh, because I was a big fan of the Wave Exceed Tour 3 and I also really liked the 5 as well. Um, just for being really lightweight and having really good uh, comfort and underfoot cushioning. And that was one of the things I noticed with this Enforce Tour is that uh, underfoot, it's uh, pretty comfortable. I'd say it's a little bit thicker and more plush in the heel and a little bit lower ride in the forefoot, but I can still feel that kind of soft, squishy uh, cushion that I like in a shoe. So overall, uh, really pleased with the comfort. Uh, like Jason mentioned, um, the fit is uh, more roomy or wider, so when I cinched it up really tight, uh, I still had some room in the forefoot. So as far as support and stability, I did like how the shoe was stable, kind of has that wider base and felt good on lateral movement. But as far as like a glove-like support, I did have a little bit of uh, wiggle room uh, kind of in the forefoot. So that was a slight knock just based on the fit. But overall, nowadays, I'm more uh, really in tune with comfort. I think it's great here. Um, I also like that it has an outsole durability guarantee with this one. So for those players out there that are on a team or grinding out long matches, that's a good thing. And uh, overall, impressed with this shoe. I would say I'm slightly more of a fan of the Exceed series just for a little bit slimmer profile. But overall, good comfort. That wraps up our play test on the Mizuno Wave and Force Tour. For more information on these shoes or anything tennis related, be sure to head to Tennis Warehouse, Tennis Warehouse Europe, or Tennis Only.